Hola, mother bitches. In this video, we're gonna be talking about the controversial new look for Domino in the upcoming Deadpool 2. Now, once this image released, a lot of people voiced their opinion on this. A lot of hateful comments all throughout the Twitter sphere, all throughout the Facebook sphere, and all throughout the YouTube sphere. There's a small percentage of people who are cool with this look, but the majority are pissed off. Because in the comic books, Domino has pale skin, black circle around her eye, and slick black hair down to her shoulders. This Domino, she's a black girl, white circle around the eye, and she has a frizzy afro on top of her head. So I can see why people are mad, especially since Deadpool is so accurate to his comic book counterpart. Why would they go and make Domino the total opposite of her comic book counterpart. You know what I'm saying? Now, when I knew Domino was going to be in Deadpool 2, I was almost 100% positive that Kira Knightley was going to end up playing Domino. For two reasons. One, she started a movie where she played as a bounty hunter named Domino. Now, I know it has nothing to do with the comic book character, but still, just the fact that she played in a movie as a character named Domino Boom, right there, made her a perfect candidate. And to top it off, at the end, very end, of the first Deadpool, Ryan Reynolds says, we might get Kira Knightley to play Cable, because she's got range. So, because he mentioned Kira Knightley, I was like, well, I know he's not going to make her Cable, but he most likely is going to make her a Domino. And sadly, we did not get that. We got this actress from Atlanta, which is a good show, don't get me wrong. But I don't think she's going to portray Domino the way we want her to. Now let's go ahead and have a look at how Kira Knightley would look if she played Domino. Let's reveal. Oh, yes. Look at this slow reveal, baby. Oh, my God. Oh, Kira Knightley, you're so sexy as Domino. Look at Deadpool behind you. He's staring at your caboose. He wants to tap that sweet ass. He wants to give you some of that dirty, dead pooly penis. And there we have it. This is how Kira Knightley would have looked as Domino. And I think it looks almost perfect. I am shit when it comes to Photoshop. So this does not look as good as it could be if somebody else, you know, put this together. But I just did this really quickly just to give you an example of how Kira Knightley would have looked. Now, I think Kira Knightley probably had other projects or just didn't really want to be in Deadpool 2 because she's a lot older than the current actress they have for Domino. But I still think she could have pulled it off, man, because Kira Knightley still looks good. She still seems like she's pretty healthy. She still could have pulled it off. So I, I don't know what. And I'm, I'm thinking maybe that's why Tim Miller left Deadpool 2 because Ryan Reynolds probably wanted uh, this new actress to play Domino and Tim Miller probably wanted uh, to stay more comic book accurate and that's where the feud happened and that's why Tim Miller decided to leave Deadpool 2. I don't really know. But anyways, what do you guys think? Do you like the new Domino look or would you rather have a more comic book accurate one? Let me know in the comments below and I will catch you on the next video. Now, before I end the video, this could just be a troll from Ryan Reynolds. Maybe he put this out here to stir up a flurry on the interwebs. To get our panties into a bunch. And when it comes time for them to release the first trailer for Deadpool 2, we might actually get this actress looking like the comic book adaptation of Domino. We don't know. We're just going to have to wait and see. We probably won't get a trailer for it till either probably February, maybe March of next year. So we'll just have to wait and find out. Anyways, thanks for watching. Adi sayonara. I was about to say adios, but I like to say sayonara. It just sounds better coming and rolling off the tongue. Sayonara.